He's the man now that has had a little ray of sunlight has come into his life in the race for the world title. That man right there, that's Tuff Hedeman. He's been strong all year long. And this week, it looks like Tuff never heard about the pressure of the NFR. I don't know that it ever changed my life, but it just fulfilled the dream I've had since I rode my first calf when I was four years old. Winning a championship just makes you want to win another championship. You just gotta live day to day and not let yourself get too excited or too disappointed because it's really a roller coaster of emotions because you know you win the round one night and you feel like oh you're on a roll you're healthy you feel good and the next night you sprain your ankle and you get drilled and you can't walk and you know i wasn't going to go lock myself in my room and get all this rest and this that and the other you know to me i always said you gotta run one bullet it's eight seconds you know how much sleep do you really need Give him a you got to be a guy that can be in the moment, all in every time you nod. I was always okay with doing that, whether or not I'd got eight hours sleep or 30 minutes. Yes, yes, 91 points. When Lane Frost was tragically killed in the summer of 1989, Tough fought through a rough season and finished the year with a second world championship. 1989 was the most difficult year I've ever been through, and, and I got through it. And uh, it, it ended on a good note with me winning the world championship and you know riding the bull longer than I was supposed to. Tough rode his round 10 bull eight seconds to seal the deal, and then another eight for his late friend. It wasn't something that I really thought about. It was just like an impulse, and I was so relieved that, number one, that I made the whistle, and that it was just the, the end of the most challenging year of my life, and a way to say goodbye to my best friend in the world at that time. It was tough, but I always say winning will cure most everything, but it didn't really cure that, but it made it a little easier to swallow. That was us, that was our life, that was our job, our dream, our goal was to make the NFR and win a world championship. That's what we thought we were put on this earth for. And uh, I was able to do that at a pretty difficult time.